The koala is a herbivorous marsupial that spends the majority of its life in trees. Native to Australia, it is often referred to as a koala bear by foreigners due to its teddy bear-like appearance. However, the two are not related. Koalas are actually most closely related to the wombat. Koalas are easily recognizable by their stout tailless body and large head with round fluffy ears and a large spoon-shaped nose. They can grow up to 85 centimeters in height and can weigh up to 15 kilograms. There are three distinct subspecies of koala, the Queensland, New South Wales, and Victorian koala. The Queensland koala is the smallest of the three with shorter silver fur and a smaller skull while the Victorian koala is the largest, with shaggier brown fur and a wide skull. The koala has one of the smallest brains in proportion to body weight of any mammal. Its brain surface is fairly smooth, which is typical for a primitive animal. As with most marsupials, the male koala has a bifurcated penis, and the female has two lateral vaginas and two separate uteri. The koala is found in coastal areas of mainland Australia, in the eastern and southern regions. Koalas typically inhabit open eucalypt woodlands, and the leaves of these trees make up most of their diet. Because this eucalypt diet has limited nutritional and caloric content, koalas are largely sedentary and sleep up to 20 hours a day. They are asocial animals, and bonding exists only between mothers and dependent offspring. Adult males communicate with loud bellows that intimidate rivals and attract mates. Because of its small brain, the koala has a limited ability to perform complex, unfamiliar behaviours. For example, when presented with plucked leaves on a flat surface, the animal cannot adapt to the change in its normal feeding routine and will not eat the leaves. Koalas may also store food in their cheek pouches before it's ready to be chewed. A koala sometimes regurgitates the food back into its mouth to be chewed a second time. Koalas are herbivores with the majority of their diet consisting of eucalyptus leaves. These are high in water content, so the koala does not need to drink very often. Females can mostly meet their water requirements from eating leaves alone. However, larger males require additional water found on the ground or in tree hollows. Koalas consume up to 400 grams of leaves per day, spread over four to six feeding sessions. They are predominantly active at night and spend most of their waking hours feeding. The koala's gestation period lasts around 33 days and the female gives birth to a single joey. As with all marsupials, the young are born while at the embryonic stage. The joey then crawls into its mother's pouch to continue the rest of its development. A female koala has two teats, one of which the joey attaches itself to and will suckle for the rest of its pouch life. At 26 weeks, the joey has its full fur and resembles an adult. It will now begin to poke its head out of the pouch. The joey fully emerges from the pouch for the first time at six or seven months of age, clinging to its mother for support. By nine months, it has permanently left the pouch and rides on its mother's back for transportation, learning to climb by grasping branches. Gradually, it spends more time away from its mother and at 12 months, it is fully weaned. When the mother becomes pregnant again, her bond with her previous offspring is permanently severed. The koala is well known worldwide and is a major draw for Australian zoos and wildlife parks. The koala is featured in the dreamtime stories and mythology of indigenous Australians. The Tharawal people believe that the animal helped row the boat that brought them to the continent. Tribes in both Queensland and Victoria regarded the koala as a wise animal and sought its advice. The first published image of the koala appeared in George Perry's 1810 natural history work, Arcana. Perry called it the New Holland Sloth. Early European settlers in Australia considered the koala to be a prowling animal with a fierce and menacing look. At the beginning of the 20th century, the koala's reputation took a more positive turn, largely due to its growing popularity and depiction in several widely circulated children's stories. The drop bear is an imaginary creature in contemporary Australian folklore, featuring a predatory, carnivorous version of the koala. 
This is a hoax designed to scare tourists. While koalas are typically docile herbivores, drop bears are described as unusually large and vicious marsupials that inhabit treetops and attack unsuspecting people that walk beneath them by dropping onto their heads from above. Koalas may live up to 13 to 18 years in the wild. At around six years of age, the koala's chewing teeth begin to wear down and their chewing efficiency will decrease. Eventually, they will wear down completely and the animal will die of starvation. Koalas have few natural predators, but are subject to pathogens such as the Chlamydiaceae bacteria. One virtually unknown risk to koalas is aspiration pneumonia, or water in the lungs, which can happen when drinking water from a bottle, as seen in numerous viral videos of well-meaning but uninformed people giving thirsty koalas water bottles to drink. The safer way to provide a koala drinking water is via a bowl, cup, helmet or hat from which the koala can lap up the water it needs. Until recently, koalas have long been hunted for food by aboriginals. When European settlers arrived, they hunted the animals for their fur. More than two million pelts are estimated to have left Australia by 1924. The public outcry over these cullings was probably the first wide-scale environmental issue that rallied Australians. Koalas are vulnerable to bushfires due to their slow movements and the flammability of the eucalypt trees in which they inhabit. Koala populations and habitats were heavily impacted by the 2020 Australian bushfire season, resulting in the death of up to 10,000 koalas. Habitat destruction, domestic dog attacks and road accidents are also major factors in the steady decline of koala population. The Australian Koala Foundation estimates that there is less than 100,000 koalas left in the wild, and possibly as few as 43,000. In 2016, the koala was officially classified as a vulnerable species.